Good morning, class. By a show of hands, I'd like everyone to show me who here likes money. Everyone, yeah. So what are some things you like to buy with your money? Toys? Yeah. Who else? Video games? One more. Food. I like to buy food too. So, can any of you tell me how people get money to buy these things? An allowance, yeah. Okay, you do chores at your house. And where do you think your parents get the money to pay you guys? Well, most people get their money by working a job. And people get jobs by being hired into them. Can anyone tell me what a person has to do to get hired for a job? That's right, a job interview. So today, we're going to talk about the steps needed in order to go to a job interview and be successful. So the first step we are going to be talking about today is to research where you're going to be interviewing now, can anyone tell me why it'd be important to do some research before you go? Yeah, those are all good answers. So research does give us information about the organization and what they, set, what they might sell or what they do. That way you kind of know what you're going into before your interview. Another way we can research is also by reaching out to people that we might know who work there, or maybe doing some research online to look at um, different forums and discussions from people who work at a company to give you an idea as to what to expect. So, step two today is looking at what skills are needed for the job that you are applying for. Now, what are some skills that you guys think you have? I'll write some on the board. Okay, hard working. Who else has an important skill? Funny, yeah, that's a good one. You're nice, okay. Yeah, those are all some really good examples and some good skills to have. <clears throat> so, why do you think it's important to look at your skills before you go to an interview? Does anyone have any ideas? Yeah, those are good answers. So it's important because you want to see if you're qualified for a job and if a job is going to fit your skills and if you're going to fit those job's requirements. So the next step in the interview process we're going to talk about is prepping for your interview. So that usually entails possibly um, preparing some answers to some questions you might expect. So why is it important, do you think, to be prepared for an interview? Does anyone have any ideas why that would be important? Yeah, those are all good answers, exactly. You want to be able to answer the questions well. That's right. So a good way of doing this kind of goes back to our step one that we talked about, doing some research. Um, you could research um, different interview questions that um, occur often in interviews to maybe kind of prepare yourself. You can write some stuff down to study for it. And by doing research on the company, you can also um, try to come up with some questions you think they might ask you. So here's my favorite step. How do you guys think you should dress for an interview? Are you gonna wear a sweat sweatsuit? Are you gonna wear shorts and a t-shirt? Some people might, yeah. The best way to dress is by wearing 
good professional dress attire 